<laughs> we got loins. <laughs> that is a fish. Travels, we just spied our first little sight of land in a couple of days. A nice little sandy cave poking out there. Looks fairly rocky around it and that though. Pretty cool what you stumble across out here. A bit of current. Glad I bought the tins. <laughs> Jill's was like Jill's was like Ariana Titmus. <laughs> Well, I mean, you know, like it's not sand, which we don't really care about. But it's a cool little K. Have a look at this filly down here. Would you imagine finding that on a sand K? Whew. Which one's that, pup? Funny, real cute. Look, I've got to say, a little um, <laughs> like a uh, serving plate. Yeah. <laughs> and then cool. just a couple of nice colours, colours yeah. yeah. little show we run over then. Nice arches. Only come up as a little mark, run back over it and you just start doing zigzags around, you know, and then now yeah, we're gonna start to run over as something a bit more substantial. So I might rig Jill up and um, I think she's good to go apart from trying some bait on. There we go. See how she goes. So we just run over that mark. 
Jules has just got pumped. Here we go. Getting some colour. What is it? It's red, just big nanny, is it? Yeah, nice nanny. Real nice nanny. That's a cracker, bub. Cracker fish. Oh, good. Sweet as, babe. Well done. No wonder. She's fat. Yeah, that's a corker. Wow. Unfortunately, <laughs> two corker. I mean, these are fucking corkers. Big chinas, man. That's what we just pulled up. They're cracking fish. But unfortunately, good for nothing. like that you run over that ground to be honest the little bit I run over well, almost I showed you I said look there's no structure that there's a bit of bait we went back and did a few circles sure enough found a nice little bit of structure bang like solid fish no better feeling we're just saying we need a bigger cutting board fish are getting too big <laughs> Happy with the spot bait? Oh, I just pumped day, like it's good. Um, I mean, that spot we just found is just, you know, I mean, three drifts for five horse fish, and we left them there. I mean, and the spot was, there's so many shows, like it's probably a little bit this size. So, yeah, it's just, it's just a pretty cool thing, you know, when you, when you find a fish like that, and it's obviously been unfished, and it, you know, it's just cool. So, um, yeah, a couple of nice amp, I mean a nice amp and a nice nanny, I mean that's all we need, you know, it's just a big part of me is telling me like, oh, I'll drop again, drop again, because what's next, but we don't need them, but um, I mean they're cool for fish, so they're happy days.
taxi today. Big drop in us over. Shara. Just had border force to do a run over. Checking the Jills is not knocking shit off. And dinner on Noosa tonight. Red Emperor. Yeah, baby. So yeah, little Arvo. First day of August. First day of August. Luckily, um, I don't know if we did a morning one. Jills did one at Sparrow Fart while I was still asleep. But, yeah, um, that's right. It's been a long day. <laughs> little Heepo there in the distance and Chara. Over that's there. our future boat, light wave. Yeah, we're pretty Radio. keen. We're pretty keen on that. It's not a bad little, not a bad little rig. Little one, I say, 38, but little when we're on this sucker. Yeah. Summer night. Little sneaky beers. Watch it on the sunset over the reef and um, Red Emperor, Red Emperor Solomon style for dinner. Um, Lisa does this style as she learned the Solomon ladies taught her and uh, it's unbelievable. So we're we'll bringing that recipe back for sure. It's been another cracking day. Cheers and more.